Keeping human beings away from the ceiling is easy, because it requires higher technology. Protecting the outer ring is a little more difficult, but can be accomplished with layers of negative reinforcement. Protecting the actual common ground is a different challenge, because digging is basic. That being said, how thick would you need to make the Flat Earth model so that people didn't accidentally dig their way through? You could use the same method as the outside barrier and create a series of undesirable layers ending in a solid barrier, but the ever-expanding increases in general population would create an unnecessary risk. If the bottom of the Flat Earth was composed of, say, an unbreakable material, this would pique the digger's curiosity and, if repeated all over the world, would raise suspicions of design. While a solid barrier works at the end of a frozen wasteland where no one is venturing, or allowed, it doesn't do much if it's found in a mining quarry, or someone's backyard. For that, you need something that hasn't been used up to this point. A scaling increase in temperature, all the way to an ignition flashpoint, and then beyond. So do some of your own research and ask questions. Please feel free to email me at msergeant23 at comcast.net or 303-494-6631.